It's a bad beard. Today's special ingredient is a beard <laughs> menu. Yes, something beginning with Colossus. That would be a much more interesting god to give you orders if he's actually just like the Iron Chef guy. What? Have you never seen Iron Chef? No. His secret special ingredient is a octopus. <laughs> what? Oh, you are wait, missing wait, the fuck. We want Dolan to sound like that. Yeah, I want him to be like the guy from Iron Chef <laughs> to give you your special. The next Colossus. Yeah, exactly. He's ultra risk. <laughs> <laughs> He's missing uh, out. He's never seen Iron Chef. It's amazing. So he'd head this way to go find Barber. He has his own arena. Yeah, I was gonna say Mark has to do with spicy all the time, but that's because never his mother one. is evil. Bell. And she's high, and she doesn't believe food is actually interesting unless it hurts. Can you see that your stamina and health bar has increased a bit? Stamina, definitely. I don't know about health. I could be wrong, but I, 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 I know stamina increases as a fight, but I wasn't sure about yeah. health. I'm pretty sure the health increases as well. Now we go into one of the mo more annoying places to control aggro. A forest. <laughs> yeah, this is kind of painful. I hate I hate forests. It's like a lot of obstacles and sometimes if you go if you go a little too much into a tree. There's the, there's the lizard, there's the lizard. Come back here. Where'd it go? Son of a bitch. I will find you. Ah, oh, I saw it. There it is. It's on the ground floor. No, don't cl you damn you. No, it's trolling me so hard, guys. Wait, it just went into the ground. <laughs> oh, it totally evaded your shit. It got away. It totally went into the ground. What the hell? It went underground. Yeah, it went oh, there it is. No. Oh. I hate you so much, but I must. Hipster Salamander. It went on the ground. Wow. That was pretty good. <laughs> that was pretty great. Is it down there? Yeah, it is. No, turn around. Really? It's in It's in this narrow passageway, so I can't actually hit it. There we go. Alright, that increases my grip meter some more, which is great. Now we can get an aggro and continue the journey. Yeah, Pip, I don't know if you were around when I was explaining. Basically, the lizards with the white tails, if you yeah. cut the tail off, you can increase your grip meter. You don't need to do it. You can totally do the game with just getting the grip boost from, um... From, like, defeating Colossus, but it's, like, you know, yeah. it's kind of useful. I agree with Pip. Makes sense. <laughs> I'm gonna just going to eat this tail, this glowing tail of a salamander. Did this, I go, I'm totally lost by the way, guys. Again, the places where you get lost, complete darkness, so you can't use your friggin' sword. Yep. Oh, tree, uh. Come on, Agro, you can do this, you, you, you deppy bastards. Right, you know, like, from the, the way you came, and then I'm out. turn. I'm out, I think. I think this is the right way. Yay, horsey. Yeah, it's this the right way. Yep, that is the right way. Woo. That is the way to the desert. And the fortress is just... It's right in front of me, yeah, I know. Begins. We'll be back here sometime. Uh, the sort of, like, pillars you can see over there on the left is how you summon uh, Phalanx, which is yep. another one of the Colossi. Is that Phalanx? Phalanx, yep. Phalanx. By the way, the desert is fucking bright. Yeah, a little bit. Really? I couldn't tell! <laughs> Dan's like, my That's eyes are I melting! <laughs> it's Ow, pretty, it's, it's pretty cool when you use the sword to, like, um, uh, laser, laser beam. And laser! The, the light around you becomes dark because you, um, like, absorb all of the sunlight. There you go, that makes my eyes hurt a little bit less, actually. <laughs> pew, pew, pew! Some people might actually remember this class, at least if any of the team's legit guys are here, because I was doing this one on Vent. Yeah. How much cursing was there? Not that much. 
Oh, okay. This guy is, isn't too difficult. <laughs> I fell, I like fell off him a lot. I was, I, I, it looked like your horse just slammed into the pillar and you were just propelled. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. I, I jumped off. I know. <laughs> it's funny to just imagine that aggro fucked you again. <laughs> Like, so, this is, so this is a fight where you don't have aggro, uh, obviously, because there are obstacles in the way. Well, there's a lot of fights you don't use aggro. There's, a, there's only a handful that you do. Yeah. But what, but he's very useful in those ones, though. Yeah. Aggro is primarily used for, like, transportation around the... Around the, um... he's, the, the easy way to explain it, he's, he's used for transportation, and he's used in colossi battles where they're a lot faster than you. Yeah. Or where there's like huge arenas and you need to like outrun them or something. Time for time for the reverse jumping puzzle, aka the falling puzzle. Yeah. Uh, it's really not difficult. <laughs> there we go. I did it. <laughs> and the funniest thing is. Wow. Really, your character just doesn't give a shit about falling. Nope. And the funniest thing is, the actual stair that you, or like... It's a door. It's just a giant door. The big ass door. Yeah, it's amazing. I wanna rock. I want a big ass yeah, rock. Like I said, this guy is Beardman. He is a deep beard, Beardman. No, he's beard man. He's not a bear, but he has a giant beard, and he is beard man. <laughs> uh, I don't know. Let's look at his face. Maybe he's got a kind of bear face. No, he doesn't. Uh, he's definitely shame. not a bear. No, that's he's, a shame. He's just a beard man. So there's there's a couple of ways to do this. We need to get to the other side of the arena. You can either get him to smash the wall for you, or you can just climb it. I didn't actually know you could climb it, so I just. I mean, he'll he'll smash through it anyway to get to you after you broke after you've jumped over it like that. Yeah. But yeah, we need okay. to be on this side of the arena. Oh, you can just jump over there. Okay. Basically, you just have to. I always thought these bit in the wall, like you have to climb the cup holders. That's where the cup holders are. Yeah. <laughs> that looks about right, actually. I think. I, yeah, he's gone through the first wall. He's 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 being a little bit slow. Just a wee bit slow. Has he even noticed you? Alright. Yeah, he's gone through one wall, so... Alright, okay. So basically the idea is we need to hide under this, um... We need to get his attention, then hide under this ledge. Because then he'll get, like, interested and take a look down. And you can climb his mighty beard! Yeah, that's yep. exactly how you do it. Yeah. I don't know of any other way to do it. I don't believe this one. See, he totally does not have a bare face. If you shoot with a gooch, then he'll definitely turn around fast. This guy took me a long time to do because I kept... I just, he, he thrashes a lot, and I just had the issue of my grip meter, meter running out. And like, yeah, you know, yeah. There's not many places you can rest on him. It's literally like, you, you can rest on his shoulders if he's not thrashing. That's about it. Mm. Yeah, Mark says it reminds him of a yak. That's not far off. Yeah, he's definitely not a bear. He's a bearded goat. It's just me mispronouncing Bad. beard man. Beard man. Hey, yo! Oh no, my beard! Get out! Honestly, climb at the beard's the hardest frame part, because obviously, like, him slightly moving his head just, like, throws you so far. Like, that, nah, I just can't move right now, because in the beard. Yeah. Hey, get Getting beard. off the beard is like number one priority then. <laughs> yeah. Yikes, you are getting thrown the fuck around. I'm almost off. Come on. Come on, just go. I'm gonna fall. Push it yeah. to the limit. Limit! <sighs> like that. Like, you've got to get off the beard as quickly as you can. Because otherwise you just lose so much grip. Oh, I should do the limit. I needed to jump more to the like. I jumped kind of in the center of the beard. I need to like go more to a side. Yeah. I can't remember how many. Does this guy have two, one or two sigils? I know he has the one he on his head. He has two. He's got one on his back, doesn't he? Yes. Oh, that one's gonna be fucking hard. <laughs> it is. Like, Shoot him he, in the gooch. He just shakes a fuck ton. Uh huh. Honestly, as, as cool, like this guy, I like him aesthetically, obviously, because he's Beardman's, but I don't, I'm not a big fan of this fight because he thrashes a lot.
There we go. There you go. See, I got off the bed like straight away. That's what you need to do. You can't just like stay on the bed or you're just gonna lose all your grip like I did last time. Oh man, you did that really fucking fast. But like, look, he just moves his shoulders and shit so much. It's like trying to. He the does. Best, this is basically your only chance to rest. Like, hey, you have to like sit here right next to the spine. And now we get on the head, and the real thrashing begins. Like, he does this maneuver a lot. Jesus! He's actually probably listening to some death metal right now. He is. See, like, look, this is the th three times in a row now. I haven't even got a stab on. Get one hit in, that should hold him still for a second. Nope. He is really... Nope. He is really, really annoying. I'm pretty sure you can stab him, j j just like quick stab him to get it. I just tried that. He didn't, yeah, he didn't do it. He, he thrashed okay. more. Okay. Because some, some Colossi, it like st it stops a bit. Yeah, I know, but like I just tried that on him. Nope. Maybe he just, just gets more angry. Oh man, I'm just watching Grip disappear. Ah, for God's sake. I need to move. Get back on his shoulders. I said, like, I really like the design of this Colossus, but I'm really just not a fan of the fight. Because he, he just thrashes too much. There we go. Getting into big hits. Yeah, I got a much better grip on him this time. Oh, you've got a way better position at the back of his neck. The big thing is if you get thrown forward too far, like you just can't get a grip with your feet because you, you're obviously there's just no place to grip. Yeah. What you've got right now is a great fucking position, like the mm -hmm. base of his neck. I, it's kind of nice that you don't have to be exactly on that goddamn sigil. Now we have to get his back. Oh god! <laughs> oh boy. Wow, what a jerk. Okay, almost that. And he's gonna stop rushing, of course. Just as you got your feet lined up. Uno, dos, tres. Now he's just moving. No, now he's gonna thrash, yeah. It's really hard sometimes to tell whether he's just like walking or whether he's actually gonna thrash. Uh, I think I can get one. No, I need to get up. I'm not gonna risk it. I don't really wanna have to climb him again, so I'm just gonna go and rest on the shoulders. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think that was a good choice because I'm about to fall off. Yeah, you sometimes just need to take a break from. Sometimes letting go. I mean, literally, like, it's not too bad, like, you can just stand here. So long as he doesn't do, like, the full-on thrash, like, you're fine. He can't actually knock you off with the shoulder sweep if you, like, stood in the middle. Yeah. You could just re regain some stamina. It would be great if someone just sort of like added in some the uh, laughter tracks as though you were actually just tickling him. He's like, oh, hey, stop it, it's tickling. God, guys, stop it, I'm foolish. There we go. That wasn't too difficult. That was a lot quicker than uh, some of the others have taken me. Yeah, no fucking kidding. It was most likely a lot quicker than the previous attempt on this guy. Oh, yeah, definitely. I think my, when I was doing my practice run of this game during the week, like, uh, <laughs> this this guy took me like, I think I fell off him about five times, six times. Oh, yikes! Yeah, it's, he's not happy with you climbing on his shoulder. Oh, that's six classes down, ten to go. You found the Triforce. <laughs> what are you talking about? What's that? Oh my god. Oh my god! Before Link just comes in, just looks up. 
<laughs> he turns into a wolf. He's like, alright, I got this. Fucking moon yeah, moon. Got this. <laughs> like, like, all of his walking cycles get redone so that he runs like a retard. <laughs> I would actually like to see Ragnar running Link. <laughs> he just fucking <laughs> flailing his goddamn sword and shield around. Hey, yeah. Yes! Yes. Epona is actually fucking. Wait, spent. wait, if he's flaming his master sword all the time, that means he's gonna shoot laser out of it yeah, all the time. You gotta make sure you're at full health or you just <laughs> by the, the act of running puts everyone at risk. <laughs> no, it gives everyone free laser he rolls, surgery. He, he rolls and side jumps. Hot, 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 hot! Best well, he, speed running tactic right, of so, Zelda Ocarina of Time will deafen you. Alright, so the next Colossus is the first um, water Colossus. Uh, his name's Hydrus. Pretty sure he uh, one of the two. Yeah, sea, sea cow count. Like, sea cow counts as water. More. Yeah. That guy's water. Um, this guy's a bitch. This guy can drown you super hard. Yeah. And he will. He's basically. Yeah. Basically a deal. <laughs> 